Hi Libra, thanks for visiting. Welcome to your weekly reading. If you like this reading, please like, subscribe and comment if that's what you'd like to do. I really love and appreciate you all so very much for all of your support on my channel. And for private reading specific to you, please visit katietarot.com. So let's take a look Libra at your week ahead. Let's see what spirit, source energy, your angels and guides would like to bring through for you Libra. Please just be patient a moment as I draw the cards for you. This reading is for Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus sign Libra. And it is a general reading, so please take what resonates for you personally and just leave what doesn't. This is where you're at currently Libra. This is what's below you, what's behind you, what's above you and what is coming in towards you. So let's take a look at your first message. We have the page of air. What a wonderful energy. I feel that this is clearer communication toward you and a loved one perhaps. It could be someone you're interested in romantically or you are in a relationship, whether it is romantic or otherwise so i'm seeing that first and foremost as a very important element coming into play libra this week i am seeing that some strange things have been happening in this relationship or dynamic something is a little bit off or strange and i'm seeing that perhaps there are going to be some stranger things that happen um, over the next week or the next little while that make you really think about things I see some synchronicities coming into play for you here, Libra. I see that there may be some interesting, perhaps difficult information to listen to or to grasp or to internalize. I am seeing though that you're going to come out victorious. This information is very important for you to move forward in a positive way for you. So Spirit really wants you to know that. Now, the keywords here are logical, honest, impulsive, and curious. And the card says challenging information, delays or changes to plans, truth delivered without tact. Now, you might find yourself in communication with a particular person, and you may find that the truth or information of any kind is thrown at you this is what I'm seeing is kind of the information is just thrown at you and it's up to you how you then react or how you then proceed and I'm seeing for you Libra that it's very wise that you are honest and open with yourself about what you are hearing or about what you are saying because of course it could be vice versa so I'm seeing that ultimately this could be a breakthrough for you uh, this energy is very positive in terms of you having uh, kind of clearing the way for your future, the information you find out or um, communications that you have this week are going to clear out the old to make way for the new. Also, I'm seeing that mentally, if there has been stress or if you have been uncertain about a particular choice or decision or thing in your life, um, you're going to start to see some strange things occur to really clear up your confusion. It's going to be um, very interesting to see how this plays out in your life this week, Libra, or even the next couple of weeks, because you're going to get um, very crystal clear about your uh, future, about your decision, or about what's happening here in your life. Let's take a look at your next card embrace change so what comes about is going to change things so the information that comes towards you a communication perhaps from someone important you've got to embrace the change that comes about and you yourself through internalizing these messages because for some of you this is going to come from spirit it's not going to come from another person and you will recognize intuitively 
what changes need to occur and you're getting clear about things through your intuition and you've got feelings on things. So embracing the change is very important. It says here, the angels applaud your willingness to embrace change with acceptance and maturity. So there are those positive elements that are going to uplift you through the changes that are going to come about. So spirit is with you here. There's such a divine, strong connection between you and spirit right now, Libra. Let's take a look at this card here. We have safe travel over the next week or very soon. Some of you may be traveling and I'm seeing that you may be deciding on whether to do this now or not. Now it says here, keep me safe and let me roam far away, but bring me home. So there is some kind of travel coming in here. Um, this can also mean in a more broad sense that you're on a journey right now and you may not literally be traveling, although some of you may be, some of you aren't. And this is the journey that you are going along. This, you want things to be safe, secure, you're um, building something or I'm seeing that you're wanting to build structure or solidity in your life. You're wanting to go along this path in life, your journey in life in in a very authentic way so i feel some of you are cutting away or it's coming into your your awareness what isn't really truth or what really isn't your truth and so this is quite a journey for you and so i'm seeing for some of you safe travel you know spirit is with you and you will be safe during this journey in life um, at this present time because for some of you you know, someone or a situation in your life may be a bit bumpy. Okay, so if that's the case, Spirit is saying here that you're okay, you're going to be okay. There is, this journey is safe for you. It is safe for you to continue down this path. Okay, because change is here awaiting you and it's going to be, um, going to be very different. I feel for some of you, what's coming up ahead to what has been previously in your past. Now we have peacefulness. Yes, I feel you wanting this. You want to bring peacefulness and balance into your life. And it says you recognize that balance, kindness, and love bring calmness to your soul. So even though there may be a storm raging outside of you, or perhaps inside of you, for some of you, you're going to be getting on top of that energy. Whether it's internal or external, you're going to have a sense of peacefulness, calm, and safety as well. So that's really lovely. Spirit wants you to know that over the next week specifically, but this energy can be moving into the future over the next few weeks for others as well. We have strength around you. So there it does seem to be, there's an entanglement here between you and another. And whether it's romantic or not, the entanglement has kind of roped you in emotionally. You may be giving away too much of your energy. You've got to be careful to maintain your own strength and vitality. And also, of course, strength indicates the fortitude to get through difficult times. So you definitely have this to back you up. I'm also seeing here that you are uh, very ferocious. There's an inner passion or an inner fierceness that's going to come out or that is just waiting to be released. This is part of the change. You're embracing this change, coming into your own passion, coming into your own truth. So this is a wonderful empowered energy here. There also may be a Leo in your life as well. Let's take a look at what is below you. We have the tower energy. So recently for some of you, and it may be around you currently for others, um, the tower energy is here, Libra. So this may be the strange thing that's happened. Something seems to have crumbled or there's been something very quick, a decision's been made and you feel that you've been thrown out of your comfort zone. And this often means that the relationship, the dynamic or whatever the situation is for you was, is not built on solid ground. So you are moving into a more harmony uh, type based relationship or environment. That's what spirit wants for you. And that's why this event or circumstance or conversation has come about. Let's take a look at what is directly behind you. The queen of swords. Libra, this is your energy here. You may be dealing with another air sign, Queen of Swords. Um, so this is someone I feel around you that is, that's been very purposeful toward you in some way. Very purposeful, very intentional, their energy toward you. 
Now, as your energy here, Libra, I'm seeing that you are cutting above the confusion, okay, or the deception, perhaps, in someone's case. You are in your own truth and you're finding your own truth. So this is very empowered. Let's take a look at what is above you. The Empress energy, the mother archetype. So you want to nurture what is going to nurture you. There's a sense here of growth and development as well in your life. A great potential for something new to be born. A new you, a new way of living or of seeing things. Or an expansion of your consciousness, of your peacefulness, of your practice. You know, it could be meditation practice or in your workplace. There's more, there's expansion here that is around you and coming in for some other people. Also the mother archetype, there may be a mother influence coming into play or you yourself may be a mother. We have the Knight of Pentacles. There may be an earth sign around you or coming in towards you, Libra. The Knight of Pentacles means that there's a slow and steady pace ahead. Now, it's okay to take stock of where you are. At the moment, you don't need to race ahead. Take stock of what's occurred here, what the tower is for you, and know and grow through this process, just like the Empress energy is here to support you in this you have the fortitude and determination to really sort out what is happening and to move forward with a new goal, with this change in mind, when the time is right, when you feel ready. So overall, we have a really positive message here for you, Libra. I feel some things are going to become clear. I feel that you have the strength and the fortitude to move forward and the loving heart and also the mindfulness to really take into account what is uh, presently around you and how to move forward in a positive way moving forward in a slow but steady but very practical and reliable way for you so really ultimately a wonderful message for you i hope you have a wonderful week ahead and i'll talk to you all again soon